Hello, everyone. So, uh, my name is Rahul, and uh, I'm a trainer from last 12 years. Total work experience is 20 years. And uh, here I'm sharing you what you guys need to know for the software testing. Many of the participants join multiple courses to get trained. But they never did the research what training is required for them. So here I am explaining you few of the things. Either you are a fresher or you are a experienced person who are working in the manual testing. So now these days the manual testing concept is little bit changed. Manual testing comes with two, three verticals. So that is also I am going to address you in this a small video. If you see the screen, so in the manual testing, the maximum companies are switched into the agile methodology. But that is the methodology where that software is being developed. But as a tester, you have to perform all those things, whatever you have learned or you have get trained or you have experience on the test technique, test case design, test case execution, bug tracking, and test plan. So these are the common things. Now the manual testing, the second vertical is API or web service testing. And this is the most important thing in these days because organization understands that even the client understand that if my business logic is working perfectly, then from the UI side, only the UI tester, only the manual tester can perform some of the things and they can verify that, yes, my application is working. It is similar to your heart is pumping correctly, your liver is functioning correctly, So the doctor can say that, okay, these are the, some minor of the issues. Whatever, if you uh, uh, get ill or sick, so the doctor will say that uh, these are the minor issue and it will be recovered within two to three days. So when the doctor examine you, that is a manual testing. But doctor examine you, based on the x-ray, based on the reports, that is the API test. So if you know the API testing very well, then of course, industry will be glad to hire you. Now the third vertical of the manual testing is the database that you are validating the middle layer, you are validating the front-end layer, but are you sure that whatever you have validated, is it correct? You need to ensure that, right? To ensure, you have to check the database. And for that, the database skill set is also required. Many companies have MySQL database, SQL Server, Oracle, MariaDB. Some company has MongoDB also. So you have to validate the database as well. So first thing, make it clear that if you learn some somewhere from somewhere that uh, manual testing only, then 
it is tough to get job in the manual testing. Believe me. Why I'm saying you, it is not to, uh, do not believe me, just go on Nokri.com, one of the latest, uh, one of the biggest job portal of India, where you can find what are the trends is going on. You search the manual testing jobs, two to four year experience, and if you did not find In any job details, manual testing, API, and database. All three combinations are required. Out, let's say uh, you search on the Nokri.com and out of 10 jobs, you got uh, two, two or three jobs. Ma automation tester is also required. So leave that particular uh, skill set, but for the manual testing, just see these skill set, manual testing, API testing, and database is required. Now see your resume and ask from yourself, is my resume meeting with the job detail? Or I have just Mention the skill set. The uh, interview can be scheduled, but am I able to clear the interview? Just two questions. That's it. Now in this uh, image, you can also see the selenium and rest assured. So what is those things? The people are switching for... Uh, okay, industry is demanding the selenium, so I should learn the selenium. And they join the course selenium. After one year, oh, uh, again, organization is asking the research automation. I need to learn the research automation. But if you see the course content, then you will identify what are the similarity what are the differences and make the strategy. No need to go for the selenium. Believe me, guys. Rest assured, one of the most demanding technology and for the next five to seven years, It will be lead. If you learn the rest assured, then the selenium automatically at least 70% you have learned. 70%. Believe me, not 50 or 60%. 70% you have already learned. Few things in the selenium you need to learn and uh, for that purpose no need to go for any training institute or any training trainer or faculty or online training you can learn those things in the organization because that is the one time activity that, that is not a every time activity. So there is nothing to learn there, in fact. Because if there is a one-time activity, then what I have to learn? If there is a multiple time, I have to perform the same time, uh, multiple uh, time I have to do uh, for the X project, Y project, and Z project, then I have to learn. But few things like a framework, like CICD. This is the one time activity. So, no need to go for XYZ training. Me, why I'm saying you, first of all, I'm also a trainer, but why I'm saying you? Because I 
always try to give a correct advice to my students, participants. Pick one technical knowledge and check whether this technical knowledge will help me help me to learn another or not. If not, then move. Simple. Hope I'm able to clear you. And uh, if you want to join to get more and more info on this. So you can see I have clearly mentioned the demo date is 17th and 18th February at 8.30 p.m. This two-day session are completely free. Then I will let you know what the technical skills you need to know, which you can multiply in multiple fold. No need to go for the other trainings. Simply no need to go for other trainings and you can work like a professionals, not a uh, just learn and uh, trying to implement and all the things. You will work like a professional. So you can join my session on that. That is the completely free of cost. There is no registration, no uh, X, Y, Z kind of things to make you payment, even the uh, 100 rupees. And the way how I teach, you can see my YouTube channel. And then you can decide. Uh, now I cannot say more than this. So it's upon to you that guys join the channel or joining the online demo session free of cost. Thanks for your time and uh, watching this video. Thank you.